After reviewing the Application Manager Overview module, you are now ready to process your adult applications. Remember, only the Chartered Organization representative can accept the adult application. To access adult applications, first select the Application Manager. Select an adult registration marked with the silhouette of an adult with a campaign hat. The application summary provides additional information you need to review regarding references and leader screening questions. The information you'll need for reference checking will be listed directly under the applicant's name and contact information. If you don't know the person, you should contact these references to make sure this individual is someone you want to serve in the leadership role in your unit. Once you're ready to approve the application, choose the Accept button. When you accept an adult application, you'll be prompted to select a position for the applicant. A drop-down list of available positions for your unit will be provided for you to choose from. If the applicant already paid online, the application will be immediately processed and a welcome email will be sent. If the application has not been paid, it will go to pending payment status found under the Adult tab until the application has been marked paid by the Council. To complete the process, click the Save button. Let's look at an application summary for an applicant that has answered yes to one or more of the screening questions. Notice the question the applicant responded yes to appears in the application summary before the reference information. Applicants that answer yes to a screening question can be accepted. The Chartered Organization representative will be required to enter a reason for acceptance in each of the comment fields for questions that have a yes response. These comments will be recorded in the application notes. If you need to reassign an adult application, select the Reassign button. The drop-down menu for Reasons for Reassignment will appear. Select the best reason for your situation. Once you've selected the reason, click Confirm. This will send the application to the District's dashboard and remove it from your My Actions dashboard. You will see the application under the Adult tab in Pending Reassignment until the District reassigns the application to another unit. If you have an application that requires additional information or you have questions for the applicant, select the Return to Applicant button. Enter your question or instructions to the applicant in the text field provided, then select Confirm. The applicant will receive an email explaining the situation along with your specific instructions and a link to a document telling them how to access their application for update. The application is removed from your My Action section and will now show under the Adult tab as Pending Applicant Response. The last option you have is Do Not Accept. If you identify an applicant you recommend for Do Not Accept, for whatever reason, select the application record and click the Do Not Accept button. You will not be provided an option to enter a reason, but the application will be returned to your counsel who may contact you to understand your reasoning for making this recommendation. Select Confirm and the application moves to the Pending Review status until the Council takes action. Now that you have processed your adult applications, you can review the status of each application by selecting the Adult tab.